Welcome back to Tennis Talk. My name's Cam Williams, and Novak Djokovic's split with long-term coach Marion Vida after working together for more than 15 years, and of course, multiple Grand Slam victories in that and world number one rankings. Let's go have a read of Djokovic's statement on his website. So this is what Djokovic had to say. Marion has been by my side during the most important and memorable moments in my career. Together, we have achieved some incredible things, and I'm very grateful for his friendship and dedication over the last 15 years. While he might be leaving the professional team, he will always be family, and I can't thank him enough for all he has done. Now, Marion Vida also came out with a statement saying, During my time with Novak, I have been lucky to watch him transform into the player he is today. I will look back on our time together with immense pride, and I'm so very thankful for the success we achieved. I remain his biggest support on and off the court, and look forward to new challenges. So there you have it. Parting ways with his coach, his longtime coach, Marion Vida, and look, Djokovic still has coaches in his team. We all know Goran Ivanisevic has been there for a couple of years now alongside Marion Vida. Marion Vida wasn't in Dubai, which kind of makes sense uh, why we didn't see him there now that we're reading these statements, but we'll see what happens with Djokovic, whether Goran steps up as his main coach or whether he does hire in some more coaches, who knows. Uh, but it looks like Marion Vida is still going to be a part of Djokovic's life, uh, which is good. So it's not a split, not a bitter split. It seems like Vida decided that he wanted to step away from Djokovic rather than Djokovic firing him. So that's good to see. Uh, they've actually gone through a lot together, together from about 2006 to 2017. So a lot of Djokovic's career, the main part of his career, winning his first slam, getting to world number one, all of those things happened during that time. And then they went on kind of a brief period of uh, not being around. He wasn't around for a couple of months there, a couple of years, I should say. Uh, Boris Becker stepped in as the main coach for Djokovic and then Vida came back and then Djokovic of course we've known what he's done since Vida has come back he's become uh, one of the greatest if not the greatest of all time so it's going to be interesting to see how Djokovic can do without Vida in his corner because in the past when Vida's not been around he has struggled but let me know down in the comments below what do you think's going to happen with Djokovic now do you think he'll be fine do you think he's too old to need a coach some players don't need coaches we've seen Federer um, Nadal those guys you know can coach themselves to some extent but what do you think do you think this is going to affect Djokovic on court now that Vida won't be around.